How come they don't allow guns in the courtroom? Why, why y'all so insecure? If you're doing the right thing, you won't have nothing to worry about. You don't see that prosecutor that got there and got her Uncle Ben Carson's. The scripture says that we read already. Never trust my enemy, man. These motherfuckers want to. You gotta rip them motherfuckers, man. They ride around and die. Well, you know what they call them. The segways. <laughs> Shit, dangerous. <laughs> I ain't never tried it, bro. I just ride a bike. <laughs> I go off road with a bike. Should have thou have stood in the crossways to cut off the those of that did escape. Neither should have thou have delivered of those of his that did remain in the day of destruction. Right, because you know, going back into uh, when Israel crossed through the Red Sea, they was looking for a safe passage. Like when they came out of the wilderness. Oh, oh yeah, oh, did you? Oh, uh, but yeah, but Esau wouldn't let him pass. It's like, no, nah, you can't go through our land. So the most side, Esau was already cursed, but he got extra cursed. You know what I mean? I got a precept for that. Man, you see, the people, all they wanted to do was cut through, man. All we wanted to do was cut through. They weren't trying to fight him. Right, right, right. At that time, Esau, they were supposed to be, uh, but they was related. They was Israel's closest uh, relative. It might be Genesis 32. I could look it up. Yeah, he thought he's, he can't trust Esau. Yeah, he know his brother, man. He know his brother better than anybody, man. But um, hey, that's he had to wait till he calmed down some. He had to cool off some. For the day of Yahweh is near upon all the heathen. I mean, that goes to the golden rule, too. Do unto others as you have them do unto you. Man, can you fathom son of, and it happened, slavery, man. Sun up to sun down, no pay, no work, you know, no pay, no pay. Families separated, children, women, wives. You had, you know, this motherfucker had five children with a woman, and they separated all the children and the husband and wife. It's some crazy shit, man. This devil. That's how he's feeling now with Donald Trump. You see 
Donald Trump's like George Bush on uh, steroids. That's, that, that's some bad shit. They say he's about a new North Korea. That's right. That's some beautiful shit. That's, that's proud right there. Yeah. And you know, the only nation that's accusing other people of weapon mass destruction is the they, 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 they're going to expose themselves right. to the devil, man. You don't see North Korea going around everywhere accusing nations. You don't see Russia invading all these other nations. Now they invaded Crimea because that is taking their own shit back. <laughs> dude, there was a dude up here talking, man, saying that uh, Kim Jong Un is crazy. When this crazy shit talks start, man, before all the Americans started saying, "Oh, he's some dictator," he ain't never heard none of that talk, man. Right. What's what the hell is Trump? I was trying to tell him that this man is not stupid, man. Kim Jong Un went to a prominent university, man. He He's went, an educated Yeah, man. he went to them schools in Switzerland. Right, that's right, right. And then, you know, this man is just not some reckless ball, you know? Nah. Shit. Wouldn't you protect your nation if you were their leader? So they building them nukes up, man. Yeah, because uh, he quoted what happened to Gaddafi and what happened to Saddam Hussein. He said, it ain't gonna happen to me. That's right, they learn, they learn, they learn. They learn it from history. Yeah. That's like what you said earlier. Learning from history, man. It's the same example, man. Same with Iran. Iran is learning from history, man. You know, they watch America. That's what they do. They see what America do, man. Right? They know he's never going to come in with people. They know he's never going to come with people. This man's coming to shed blood. He's coming to shed blood. That's blood going. Yeah, he's coming to take what not his. They talking about, oh, we want to use diplomacy. <laughs> what the fuck is diplomacy? That's peace. That's talking, man, talking peace. Oh, I got a scripture. That's that fourth tongue. Well, that's yep. Once this devil get taken out of the way, these are wicked motherfuckers gonna bow yeah, down. Man. Man. Once this devil get taken like out of the way, these people gonna bow down. I'm like, that's been a minute since I got that. I was about to get songs for you. By that time, this devil's taken out of the way, we're gonna have spiritual power, man. Because the Lord said, with thee will I break in pieces. With thee will I break in pieces. Awesome. With thee will I break in pieces. Atomic bombs on human beings was America. I'm what? One. They dropped two. It wasn't Russia that did that. It wasn't North Korea. That was a that was America. Terrible. Well, it was terrible. So far, terrible. It was terrible. America. What Libya? What Iraq? What Afghanistan? The Sudan? All these places where America is talking. It wasn't Yemen. No. You know the Americans don't want to hear that though. Yeah, but it was uh, by uh, the Macedonians. None of the Ptolemies came up with that. Up in Egypt, they might have been in that show. That's part of it. I heard that name like six rappers. I ain't watched that whole show. I started watching. I remember the main actor died halfway through. They had to get a new one. Watch the early early episodes. Damn. That was a bad idea. Hold up. Yeah. No, no, no. I don't know exactly when, but they had to replace him. 
No, no, no. I'm talking about the actor guy. And they had to replace the actor. Not the character. Oh. So. Oh, Except for that one? You know, you know the MO of our people. We'll do anything to make some money. Anything, man, anything. Watch these YouTube videos. Not just YouTube videos. Do a search on Google what people are doing to make money. You're about to like pop. What? You're probably pop. Oh, go ahead. <laughs> and it was a couple, this dude was, a, it was like a prank or whatever. Dude walked into a couple and said, I get $10,000 for I had sex with your wife. Like, yeah, yeah, go ahead and do it. She was actually acting like, uh, uh, right. and she, she agreed to it. Right. Yeah, yeah. I'll do that quick. Yeah. They got a movie on that. Uh, Indecent Proposal. There you go. Indecent Proposal. Yeah. So people do anything. Yeah, well, that, that, that was a movie. They made a lot of money off that movie because right, people right. was intrigued by that, yeah. that concept. Right. They put a beautiful woman to play the role. Who was that? Demi Moore, wasn't it? Oh. Uh, that Demi no, Moore? No. Uh, wait a minute. I think it was Demi Moore. I think it was. Years. I think it was, yeah. Demi Moore. She's a good at that back. Woo-hoo! Hollywood is a light. See, that's an Israelite. And he, well, you know. And her last name's Moore. You know, a lot of so-called white folks got that last name Moore. That goes back to the Moore. Because the word Moore means brown. The word sit shit the word semite comes from, from a, a man named Shem. You know about the story of Noah? When Noah got off the ark, he had three sons. Noah had three sons, Ham, Shem, and Japheth. So the word semite is the descendants of Shem. And it, uh, which includes a whole lot of people. So th that's a misnomer. People throw that word semite around, they don't understand what it truly means. Because the Shemites are uh, well, there's more than one Shemite uh, nation, though, because you have Ishmaelites, Israelites, Edomites. The Arabs are part of the chosen nation. They came to Shem. They're not Shem. Yeah. It don't matter. The chosen nation is the chosen nation. The Lord brought, the Lord separated the nation. He made slaves for the Israelites, which are, uh, what am I thinking about? And that's really the so-called Jews. That, that's that little sneaky way of saying they're not really Israelites. Those they're not really lying to you. They're just Shemites. Right? So, I mean, yeah, they should be Shemites. Yeah, a whole lot of nations came from Shemites. Right? Right. 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 The Ishmaelites, right. Edomites, Ammonites, right. Moabites. You know, a lot of nations. Right. 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 Separated sons of April, Adam, he set the bonds of people according to the number of the children of Israel. Yeah, the Lord was not with that. Thank you. He was not with everybody coming together. That's why, he, hey, read, let him read that again. Listen to this again. It says, Deuteronomy 32, 8. It says, when the Most High divided the nations. Listen, when the Most High divided the nations. He separated the sons of Adam. He separated the sons of Adam. Because you had a lot of, all men come from Adam, but the Lord separated them and made different nations. And each of them was given their own land and own territory. Go ahead. He set the bounds of the people according to the number of the children of Israel. Because the Israel is the chosen people. Keep going. For well, Yahweh's portion is his people. Jacob is the lot of the territory. So Jacob is the lot of the Lord's inheritance. So there's a lot of different sons of Adam, a lot of nations. But only Israel had received that inheritance, which was the, 
to be rulers in the kingdom of heaven. And that's that's what the Bible says. Birthright. You know what I mean? Yeah, you don't birthright. see us making this up, dude. You see us reading it out the scriptures, right? <laughs> and that's why we out here, though, you know? It's the last day. It's the last day. It's the last day. People that are no longer being destroyed. That's one of those mysteries, though. That's a biggest mystery on the planet Earth. I'm just checking out the sixth Oh, this goes hand in hand with that. Upon the sixth day, thou gavest commandments unto the earth that before thee it shall bring forth beasts, cattle, and creeping things. And after these, Adam also, whom thou gavest forth. All thy creatures of him shall we all, and the people also whom thou hast chosen. The people whom thou hast chosen. So who is that? That's the children of Israel. Okay. Well, we got to read the Hey, that's proper that's English. All right. That's all right. It's still English. You still understand it, though, right? You still understand it. Because really, really, they, really, they have bastardized the English language. Modern English is all messed up. And really, the, 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 the language in the Bible is more of a pure form of English. Actually, when you really look at it. And now they, they prefer to make like I'll give you an example. In the Bible, it uses the word gay. But now you hear the word gay, what do you think that means? A homosexual, right? But in the Bible, in the real English, not modern, the word gay means to be happy. It means uh, something nice, like gay clothing means nice clothes, you know? So that's how they perverted the English language. Verse 55, all this have I spoken before thee, O Lord, because thou madest the world for our sakes. Listen to this. As for the other people, which also came from battle, thou hast said that they are nothing. <laughs> Whoa. But be like unto spittle. Wow. And has likened the abundance of them unto a drop that falleth from a vessel. Every time I read this, man. Yeah, you just <laughs> makes you laugh. Right, right. And now, O oh Lord, behold, these heathen, which have ever been reputed as nothing, have begun to be lords over us and to devour us. That's what, and that's what you see to this very day. We're being devoured by these heathens. That's right. The many clever ways they came up with. The many clever ways. The, the inventions of the heathens. That's right, that's right. Oh, that's a powerful scripture. That's right. Yeah, the truth is amazing, though, man. You're just not ready for it. We've been, we've been taught so many lies our whole life. All you gotta do is sit down and read this book. You know what I mean? Dash babies' heads, what? <laughs> what? Yeah, so you're gonna dash the Edomite's baby <laughs> against the stones. That's so One, yeah, 137. <laughs> you ain't That's ready for that. Down, that don't sound like no baby kissing the Lord. Golden tablets. So they said an angel gave Joseph Smith some golden tablets, and it was written in some lost Egyptian script or something. <laughs> that sounds suspicious. Go the other way. Oh, and, oh, everyone. And the brothers. Go ahead, Oh, no, he was checking out. 